In today's video, I'm gonna be showcasing you guys this cool ghost trail effect. It's very easy, but it makes your videos stand out a lot more than usual. So if you're looking for something to just spice up your videos a little bit, this is definitely an effect that I would recommend. So as you can see, we're actually already in Premiere Pro. I'm gonna choose a segment from this video. This is MGM Let, True That. This song is actually sick. Video is hard as well. But um, let's just choose this segment right here. Right click, replace with After Effects Composition. So the first thing you wanna do is you wanna go to your row a brush and you just want to rotor brush your subject make sure you keep it clean as possible i'm just going to do this rough so now i've done my rotor brush we're actually just going to make sure that each frame is still got our subject highlighted okay so when we click on composition you can see that that is our subject rotoscoped okay so that is the first step make sure you do that so once you've got your rotoscope, you then want to duplicate it twice, go to the third layer and delete the rotoscope. So now we actually have our background. You want to go to the second layer and you want to go to effects and presets here and type in echo. You want to then drag echo to your second layer. And as you can see, we've already got some sort of effect here. If I zoom in, you can kind of see that duplicate there. All right. So what we're going to do is we're actually going to make this just a little bit more cleaner gonna give the feather around 15% that's what I love to do and take this shift edge to about minus 100 I love it at that stage because as you can see it's just a lot more cleaner okay so that's what I like to do it's all preference at the end of the day the next thing you want to do is you want to make sure that you're on your second layer and you go to your effect controls for echo and you go to number of echoes you change that to around eight okay and you want to change your decay to say around 0. 60 for example okay and this is what's going to give it that nice smooth effect and as you can see it's a small effect it's nothing too crazy even if we brought this up to say 0 0.75 that might look a bit better look at that man that is cool simple and it just brings your videos to life a little bit more so if we was to actually render this part here let the clip run through there we go simple but kind of effective you know what i'm saying and uh, we can do this again on another part of the video right click and replace with after effects composition i'm going to do this quite quickly because you guys know what the first step is now just make sure you rotoscope your layer make sure that our subject is selected and as you can see, we are fully selected there. No issues, no problems. Click on your composition. You can watch that. Duplicate a layer twice. Go to your third layer, delete your row. So again, I like doing these tutorials just so you can see step by step, even though if you watch the first tutorial or the first effect, like I'm happy to do it again bit by bit so you can actually see the process slowly instead of me rushing it. I add my echo again to my second layer. I change the number to eight and I change the decay to around, let's see 0 0.75, see what that looks like. Yeah, that looks cold. And maybe just add a nice motion blur there as well. I actually forgot to do that for the first effect, but yeah, if you wanna add that motion blur, make sure you do. Don't forget your feather like I did and your shift edge. I like to create that effect. This is my style. Very simple, very clean. Look at that, man spices up your video it's an easy effect but it just makes everything look really cool really nice man really nice really nice so yeah that is how you do the ghost trail effect if you guys want more tutorials like this short simple snappy tutorials where it's just you know one effect and you guys want to learn that then uh, feel free to put that in the comment section below if you want more of these again i appreciate everyone's support on this channel let's hit 1k subscribers man but yeah guys i appreciate everyone's support on this channel we're nearly at 1k subscribers so if we could hit that before june time that would be much appreciated but again thank you to everyone that's been watching all of my videos and just supporting me in general if you do want more tutorials like this where it's just you know one effect and i'm really focusing on that one transition then make sure you put it in the comment section maybe give me some suggestions as well i'm open to doing videos from the comments so yeah again make sure you hit the subscribe button like this video and i'll see you in the next one peace